Now, local sports from KGBO. What's up, folks? We start tonight with some summer basketball and a tumble in the final day of the Northeast camp. A tumble in white against Uniontown, Kansas. Sam Moreland drives into the lane and finds his brother, Matthew. He drives baseline and puts in an easy layup. Atama goes up 25 to 16. Later in the half, Noah Boyer using that length on defense. He then leads the break and finds Moreland, who finds Jalen Strunk for the easy deuce. Bulldogs up 15. Closing minutes of the game, Dalton Bowers pops out to the three-point line. And guess what? Yeah, Muffins. He drains it. Atama up 26, and they win by the same margin. Bulldogs win 51 to 25. The summer games, we just try to get our guys to play hard and uh, share the ball, which we did a, a better job of that today. I, the summer hasn't gone well at all times, but, you know, just getting the guys here and getting them to play hard goes a long way. Success in game two against Princeton. From the top of the key, Noah Boyer finds Gage Ryder deep in the paint for an easy bucket. Close 5-3 to three game then, but it doesn't stay that way. Ryder returns the favor and finds Boyer on a great cut to the basket. Bulldogs go up, go up 10. And good things happen when all five players on the court touch the ball. The ball finds Trent Jones, and he has a nice move in the paint. OHS up 18 then. Bulldogs end the tourney on a good note and win by 25. Final score, 61 to 36. The newest edition of the high school softball rankings came out this week. The Eddyville Rockets girls are still number two in Class 2A. The Rockets entered the rankings at 22 and 4, but today fell to Burlington 8 to 3, but top North Mahashka 10 to 0. The Fairfield Trojans are back in the rankings. The Trojans fell from the rankings but climbed back to 13th with the help of a three-game winning streak over last week. Fairfield then extended that win streak to 4 with a win over Central Clinton on Friday. Earlier today, Kirksville North Park played host for the ASA Fast Pitch Softball Tournament. 25 different teams competed in four different classes of softball. There was 10 and under league, a 12 and under league, a 14 and under, and a finally a 16 through 18 league. Kirksville had cat squads in all divisions but 10U. Skyler had its squad rocking pink in the 16 to 18 league. And Atlanta SWAT was in the 12 and under league. Queen City also had its gold rush team in the 10U competition. Of the 25 teams, three teams in each division placed in the tourney. The two-day tournament started this morning with pool play and finishes tomorrow afternoon with championships. Tomorrow's first games start at 8.30 a.m.